Hello. Hello guys, Janlik97 here. And I guess I will start recording again, considering it is Christmas break. And you know, you would think, you know, I have the collection disc on, but what game am I gonna play? Well, could I be playing The Legend of Zelda? No. Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link. The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Oh, wait, I already played that. No. We are going to be playing The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. This game is absolutely amazing. I I am for sure I will be getting 100%. I'm going to try. I mean, there's a couple things, you know, I'm going to I'm going to have a little problems with like if you guys already know, I mean, if you haven't played the game before, I recommend you know, you could you know, start playing the game and then just watch or you can watch while you play and you know, it's a let's play. You guys can choose a video game walkthrough. I do this solely for my viewers, my whole 30 viewers. But anyway, you know, this game, I have a lot of memories on, you know. This was the very first game I ever played. Like, it's the first video game I've ever played in my whole life. This is what I started out with. I was four years old when I first played this. It came out in 98. I was born in 97. But, you know, I was only one years old, or one year old, when that came out. So, you know, I'm not exactly, like, I can kind of develop a memory, but not too much. So, let's go ahead and move on. You see, I have done a three heart run. I have actually beaten the game with three hearts. That was a failed attempt. I was going to start this as an LP at one point, but something happened and I didn't continue. I don't know what happened. I'm confused too. I've done a 100% run, so how about we just get this going. You know what? Let's just do Link. I want to make it seem like that we're actually playing as Link. You know what I'm saying? So, zero, 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 three hearts. Press yes, and let's go. In the vast, deep forest of Hyrule, long have I served as the guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree. The children of the forest, the Kokiri, live here with me. Each Kokiri has his or her own guardian fairy. However, there is one boy who does not know or does not have a fairy. Uh, wow. We're only, well, I guess we had squawk yesterday because of the weather here in Illinois. We kind of had some bad weather. And of course, all the snow's dried up, or dried up, melted, and it's starting to dry up. I mean, it, it only yesterday. I mean, like, it was freezing cold yesterday. Holy crap, it's Ganondorf. Yeah, it's Ganondorf, guys. It's Ganondorf. Gondendorf. Navi, Navi, where art thou? Come hither. Oh, Navi the fairy, listen to my words. The words of the Deku tree. More like the dick tree. Okay, I'm not going to steal anything from uh, or, uh, Nintendo Capri Sun. Dost thou sense it? the climate of evil descending upon this realm. Malevolent forces even now are mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. I love that line, mustering. I just think of mustard. That's what I think when I see that word. For so long, the Kokiri Forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier deterring 
outsiders and maintaining the order of the world. But before this tremendous evil power, even my power is this nothing. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead Hyrule to the path of justice and truth. Navi, go now. Find our young friend and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, Navi, fly. The fate of the forest, nay, the world, depends upon thee. Alright, I'm gonna move my mic a little bit away so it doesn't pick up my voice, so the sound won't show up, my doll. What's going on? Yeah, but some of the, you know, some of the uh, dialogue in this game is a little poetic. Uh, the guy that humps a rock, and, you know, I also have to point this out. If you've played the 3DS version of this, Navi actually does not hit it. She goes right through the gate the fence and goes right to Link's house. She doesn't hit the fence before she goes through it. Which is... In one part in that game that made me mad, there are a lot of parts in that game of the remake that made me mad. Hello, Link. Wake up. The Great Deku Tree wants to talk to you. Link, get up. Hey, come on. Can Hyrule's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? Oh yeah, and with Conqueror's Bad Fur Day, I, in all honesty, I have to go back and play the th game through again, because I have not played it in so long. The last time I played it is when I recorded, so I'm going to have to play through the game again to get used to it, and then I will continue on. But since I have not played it in a while, I'm not going to do it. So it'll be discontinued for a while until I can get used to it again. I don't know if I'll be able to record it over uh, Christmas break, but I'll try. You finally woke up. I'm Navi the Fairy. Or I hate you. The great Deku Tree asked me to p be your partner from now on. Nice to meet you. The great Deku Tree has summoned you. So let's get going right now. Okay, so we get control of Link. Of course, the control stick is to move. Uh, L is to, well, I can show you that later. B will be for something else. Y will be the left C, like if you go left on the C stick, it would use the item on the left. Y is the left, Z is the bottom, and X is the right and Navi will have a little thing popping up at the top and you have to use the thing to do holy crap <laughs> I did not know you could do that that is cool oh there's Link see of course you can backflip and I guess you can't backflip in here, but, you know. But we can just go ahead and go out here. Kokiri Forest. This place is always fun. It's like one of the easiest areas in the game. Yahoo! Hi, Link! And with the piece of hearts, you know, it, it is going to get a little confusing to me at first. I'll be able to, I will get them all, I promise you that, but I'm going to have a little problems remembering what I've gotten or not. I don't have a, well, I have a checklist, but I don't know where it went, so we'll just do it from here. Wow, a fairy. Finally, a fairy came to you, Link. Wow, that's great news. I'm so happy for you. Now you're a true Kokiri, Link. Is that right? The Deku Tree has summoned you? It's quite an honor to talk to the great Deku Tree. I'll wait for you here. Get going. Go see the Deku Tree. Okay, let's go. Shut up, Navi. You're annoying. Hey, you, Mr. No Fairy. 
What's your business with the Deku Tree? Without a fairy, you're not even a real man. What? You've got a fairy? Say what? Say what? The great Deku Tree actually summoned you. What? Why would he summon you and not the great Midol? This isn't funny. I don't believe it. You aren't even fully equipped yet. How do you think you're going to get going to help the great Deku Tree without both a sword and shield ready? What? You're right. I don't have my equipment ready, but wait. I think Link just talked there. Okay. In all honesty, I actually think Link talked there. Because usually Link doesn't talk. He's a mute character. He's a mute protagonist. It's... You know, games with mute protagonists, yeah, it gets annoying sometimes, but you get used to it. I mean, Link is a character to love. And you cannot, you cannot hate Link. It's just, it's just impossible to hate Link. Okay, so I would recommend throwing and breaking all the rocks you can to get some rupees. You know, just kind of... Go around, break all the rocks, while well, this guy humps that one. Because technically you're like the strongest in the town or something like that. I, I don't know. Alright, so let's go in here. This is my doll's place. Alright, let's open this chest. And we get the green rupee. Okay, what's in this one? Yes, blue rupee. That would be worth five rupees. What's this one? And that's a recovery heart. One of the most useless items in the game. Why stuff a chest with a heart? We could stuff it with rupees. Jeez. Alright. Blue rupee. We got 19 rupees. We need 40 for the shield. Which I could hop up back here. Get 5 rupees and get 24. So I'll have 24. Alright. And, hey, look, another one I can break. Nope, nothing. Hello. Okay, so... I think, right here... If I do this right, I can actually get a 20 rupee here. I think it is possible. Shut up, Navi. Trying to do something. Ah, messed up. Here, I'll just do it this way. I am wasting a lot of time. I'm 13 minutes into the video and I haven't done crap. Oh no, no, no. Okay. What? I thought you could. Oh, there we go. There are the rupees. Alright, I have 30. And once I get out of here, I'll have enough rupees to get the shield. Alright. And of course, you can crawl through little tunnels. Alright. There's a big boulder here, so look out for it. And it's fast, so get out of its way. Alright, we have enough rupees to get it now. But first, we must get this. I got the thing! We got the Kokiri Sword. It's a hidden treasure of the Kokiri, but you can borrow it for a while. Be sure to practice with it before you really fight. Okay. Well, if you pause it, you can see there is the map, and this is your current position in Kokiri Forest. This is your select item screen, but we don't have any items to use, of course. This is your quest status screen, you know, piece of hearts, items you'll be getting later, your songs, basically all that. And then here's you. Your equipment screen, you can equip things. Yes, you can see there's going to be different swords, different tunics, and different. So you have the to Kokiri tunic and the Kokiri boots. There's going to be different boots, swords, you know, shields, tunics. I mean, I'm not going to ruin it for you, but 
you'll just have to see what we're going to do next time. So next time on Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, we will continue on to see the Deku Tree. See you later.